So we we went to VidCon and we met Shea Carl and we snapped our before pics with thoughts of tomorrow. Now we we've got a job to do. Subscribe and follow on YouTube. After pics when we arrive in Orlando for playlist live. Buckle up, Brodies, for the ride. This is Strive to Live. Hola, Brodies. Hi. So we went shopping today. We bought a few little gadgets. Sorry we didn't vlog. My battery was a little low. Yeah. And every time I tried to, it said, uh, no, try again. <laughs> and Lisa's cam Lisa's phone is um, non-iPhone, so it doesn't uh, work correctly when you want to vlog something. It works. It's just, it's not it's no. good quality. It's not up to par. The audio doesn't sync. Okay, but Lisa bought new walking slash jogging slash trotting slash running shoes. <laughs> Actually, Jen bought them for me for my birthday. Would you like to see them? Of course you would. Wait, roadies, get your sunglasses on. They're a little vibrant. They're a little vibrant. So these are BT Dubs. It's the Nike Free Run Plus 3s. Like I said, vibrant. Are you ready? Get your sunglasses. Hurry, pause this and get them. Okay, you've been warned. <laughs> Shut up. If you want to know the color, I'll tell you the color. They are in the color... Volt, Reflex Silver, and I want to say it's going to be Platinum, but they're like highlighter green, so, yellow. So Lisa got them today, and I was like, you know what, I, they're, I mean, they're vibrant. I really like the orange, but I said, I bet you they're not going to be that comfortable, though, because because they just don't seem like they're that comfortable to me, right? Because, like, look, these are the shoes I wear. I'll show you. These are my shoes, right? They're the Air Max. And they're Nike Plus, too. Yeah, okay, so these are the shoes I wear when I go work out or just every day or whatever. Oh. Oh, so, smell like I'm just playing. Are you done? I'm done. Okay. So these are the shoes I wear, right? So I was like, they just them two don't seem like they have any They're support so to them. So amazing. So we get home and I try them on. Wait, she tried them on and Val tried them on. I tried them on, and uh, as soon as we're done vlogging, I will be going online and ordering me a pair. But I want the orange. Yes, they are so amazing. Cause look, I have, I have a short foot, but, but I a have, fat foot. I have. A but wide foot. foot. Wide? A wide, not, don't use the F word. Fat. Rude. It's a fat foot. Wait, oh. Keebler L foot. <laughs> Keebler yeah, L foot, I exactly. Do. I have small Well, let me feet. tell you what the guy at the at the shoe store, the first shoe store we went to said. We walked out of there because I felt this was kind of rude. And he, it wasn't rude. A rough. salesperson should not say this. Okay, so Lisa said, you know, that she needs running shoes. And I was he looking looked, for these. He looked at her and he did the up to down look. He was like, oh, trying to get in shape. I was. <laughs> I overlooked it because I mean it's just it is what it is. But it is rude. That's what it, it is. I mean it was rude, but I was like you know I'm not about to let him ruin my day because I don't feel like going to jail. Um, but yeah, Brodies. So Nike Free Run plus, plus three. threes. I mean, and because y'all know I bought my watch. I don't know. Did I show them my watch? I think I showed them my watch. If not, I'll show you tomorrow. But I have um, it's called the Nike Sport Band. I'm sorry, but that just smells so good. That's all mine. No, hell no. Um, but it's got the where they're Nike Plus, so you can put the chip in it, and the chip syncs to my watch. And once I plug, and my watch like comes out of the little band, and it plugs into my computer, so I can like compute. It tells you how many calories you burn, your distance, your pace, the time, all this mumbo jumbo. But I'm so excited. You're the best. Oh, thanks. Better than all the rest. You're welcome. You're so welcome. Um, Brodies, let me go to the bike situation. Yes. So, somebody in the comment section said maybe try a bike store, like a bike store that only sells bikes, like a shop, right? And yeah. maybe you'll find a better quality, better bike there. So, we went to a bike store today. The cheapest bike they had was just about $300. Oh, you have a low battery, but it's okay. Well, we're good. So, $300 for that. No bike. joke. That was the cheapest one okay. they had. And I didn't even like that bike. The bike I really liked was four seventy nine. But let's be honest, I'm not spending five hundred dollars on a bike. Oh no. Real quick, these were a hundred dollars, by the way. I, if, just in case you guys are wondering, they retail for a hundred dollars. Go on ahead. Sorry. So we decided we we're just gonna drive around and, and we were going shopping and as well. We passed a flea market. Yeah. Somebody was selling bikes. So we got three not one, mountain not two, bikes. But three. For ninety dollars. Now, yes, they are used bikes, but 
once I put my brand new big butt seat on them. They're good with me. I have to put um, a brake set on it, but I mean, 30 bucks is better than alone, 500. The one alone retails for 400, 400 bucks. It's, it's a Trek. The name brand is Trek something. T -R -E -K. I looked it up when I come home and it retailed for $400. So good, good deal for thirty bucks, right? Because really, all I wanted is to go around the track. Yeah. You know, and I really it doesn't have to be no We're fancy schmancy thing. I just wanted something that you know was so. What well, we were gonna pay for one bike? We got three. We got three. So now Skinny Sister can go and Val can go. Yeah. So we're all gonna go bike riding. We're all gonna go bike riding. I have to go get the brake set, which I meant to get tonight, and I totally forgot. So yeah. I have to get that tomorrow, so we can but put that's the no brake set on there. My dad says it takes like ten minutes to put on. So yeah. So, but look at now we got our bikes. Go bike riding. Got shoes. Got shoes. We're excitable. Um, what else? Oh, roadies, we weighed in today. Yes. You know what? Somebody asked me, I think it was Jenna, asked me what day was going to be weigh-in. Saturday. Short notice, but Saturday's going to be weigh-in day. What? You want my shoes? Oh, yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. Saturday's going to be weigh-in day, which I know it's short notice for you guys, and by the time you guys watch this, it might even be Saturday night or Sunday or maybe even Monday, but, um... Saturday will be weighing, so let me show you what we weighed. As you can see from this picture, my first weight was 261.9. With that weight, which I don't remember what it was, I think it was 257.3, maybe, or 2.1, maybe, 0.1. Um, so I lost 4.8 pounds. Yes. Awesome. Lisa, as you can see right here, weighed. She lost, what'd you weigh? 271.2, I believe. Two? Two. Okay. I believe. Uh, whatever the the picture says, that's what she weighed. I don't remember at this very second. But she lost 1.6. Yes. Now, we know where Lisa went wrong this week. Yes. Yesterday, Lisa had, she made like chicken the fajitas. Y'all know, we did it for Teleport Tuesday, a couple weeks back, like a while ago actually. And I made the chicken fajitas. So, my whole goal, my whole plan was to wrap it in lettuce, right? I go in there, and that wasn't lettuce, it was celery that I saw. I know, I know. And so we didn't have any whole wheat tortillas, and so I was like, well, bummer. So we had some leftover, like, um, taco chips? Tostito chips, kind yeah, of. Yeah, Tostito chips, but it's just like a no-name brand. And so I had a few with those. Well, once I was done, I could tell I was really, really thirsty, and I was like, yep, that was a bad move. So I know where I went wrong. But. And here's another thing that she doesn't take into consideration is that she wakes up late and goes to bed late. Yeah. So she expect. drinks water till like three or four o'clock in the morning. So that had to, that had to weigh part of that too. So yeah. we're gonna try to get that under control. Yeah. But I still lost. Ladies, highlight. Our mom and sister Val is doing this journey along with us, and our mom's gonna become a roadie soon. Yes. She has to lose 17 more pounds. She becomes a roadie, right? Yes. That's like her goal. So, but this week. Garcia household, we lost 12.1 pounds. Oh, snap. That's pretty good for week one. Pretty darn. That's Shnazzle pretty lazy, good for week one. 12.1 pounds. We are excited. We are happy with that number. Yes. Definitely. Yes. Um, so, every Saturday we'll be weighing. I know we weighed in the first time was on a Monday, but that's because it was our famous, it's Monday, we got to get it serious here. Yeah. So, every weigh-in will be um, on Saturdays. So if you want to weigh in with us, you can post your way into this in the comment section or leave a video response with your way in and we will talk about it manana or the day whenever you post it. Or you can weigh yourself and keep it to yourself. Whatever you want to I do. mean, you don't have to share it. We just share it because it keeps us accountable now that we're on this Strive to Life. But if you don't want, if you just want to know for you, because let hey. me tell you, for us, our new roadies who have just found our station or channel, mm -hmm. This isn't the first time we've oh, yeah, tried no. doing this. I mean, no, no. I, I can't tell you. I mean, I'm 31 years old. I can't tell you how many times I've actually tried to lose weight. Yeah. But I can tell you this. When we went to VidCon, something changed mentally. It was, it was like um, it was like a switch went off. Mm -hmm. And just talking to Shay and seeing Shay. And see, I, I think it meant more because I knew where Shay came from. Yeah. You know, I, I seen him um, at his heaviest. You know, and seeing the struggle of him trying and falling off track. And then trying again and falling off track. You know, and then succeeding at it finally. And, and doing and, a damn good job you at know, it. And look just amazing. Like, he you know, looks so, amazing. I think, I don't know, it just, it just, it changed me, and I, I honestly believe, like today, you know, we went out, um, all day, we went out, and um, usually on Saturdays, if we're out shopping, we'll go somewhere, sit down restaurant, and we'll have something to eat, and, you know, appetizer, you know, whatever, and then the main you know, course, and, and soda, today, we, oh, talking about oh, soda, we haven't drank soda in over a week, 
Yes, roadies, which is hard. That is and hard. Like, oh my god. It was like day two, maybe day three. All the headaches. And I had such a bad caffeine headache. It was horrible. It was terrible. It was horrible. So I, I woke. I took a town. I took two town on. I had fallen asleep, and um, and I told Lisa, I was like, part of me just wants to drink some pop and be done with it because this headache is ridiculous. And what I tell she you? said, you know what, just. Just, you know, lay down a little longer and relax. She's like, it'll go away. We can make it through tonight. By tomorrow, you'll feel much better. Yeah. And I didn't drink no pop that night. And I'm telling you, I feel so much better. I do. And even like today. So we went out and um, we were out shopping and about. And we had Subway for lunch instead of going somewhere to sit down restaurant. Which, you know, some might say Subway's not the best. But it, it was better than McDonald's. You know what I mean? It was better than a fast food choice. And it was only a six inch. Yeah, we, we got a six, six inch, inch um, and baked chicken chips. breast. And we shared chips. Yeah, so, I didn't even eat all mine. And, and I, got, I got lemonade. And um, a vitamin water, a triple X vitamin water. Um, <laughs> so, we, you know, and then um, we did treat ourselves tonight with a frozen yogurt. Yeah, and but that it was, was loads of fruit. Oh my god! It was um, so good. I had strawberries on mine and a little bit of coconut sprinkles. Um, I just have strawberries. It was it was really good though, and we got a small, but it was just a little treat to say, hey, you know, on Saturdays is the day we just we come to a conclusion that if we want something sweet or some treat, then we do because that. it's weigh in day. So like if right. this morning, let's say we have something, we have the whole week to, to burn work it. it off. Right. You know. So so, roadies. With that said. That's pretty much all we did today. Oh, wait. Two more things. What? One, we did not make the fish tacos yesterday because it was so hot here that we couldn't imagine putting that stove on, to be completely honest with you. Two, we were going to make the quinoa, but I, we didn't. The, when we got to the bulk store today, it was already closed. So we have to go there bright and early tomorrow morning and get the quinoa, and then we have everything to make that, if not tomorrow, for sure Monday. Here's a question. Yes. Mondays are meatless Mondays. Yes. But can we still have fish on Monday since fish is technically considered a fish, um, meat? I think so. I'm voting this right now. I think Monday will be our what fish What do you guys Monday. think, Rodis? I think Monday, I, if it's not meat. Well, during, not to be all, like, religious, but, like, during Lent. Yeah, no meat on Friday, uh, you can have fish. on Friday, but you get fish, yeah. I got, I mean, if God says it's okay, it's cool with me. <laughs> it's cool with me, too. I mean... Who am I to judge? <laughs> so that's what we're going to have on Monday, I think, is uh, yeah. fish tacos with a, with a mango slaw. It is so good, roadies. Could you oh, insert the pictures of our bikes that Val texted you? Oh, I will. I'll insert the pictures right here. You'll see what our, our bikes look like. Yeah. So as you can see, that I mean, yeah, they're not brand new, but hey, for our purposes, they're great. But mind you, we're getting big butt seats. <laughs> yeah, because did you see the one on the red one? I'm not even going to tell you what I told you. <laughs> Don't tell her. Don't tell her. I, like, I have a feeling that get lost somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh roadies. It's but it's kind of muggy here tonight. I think it's going to rain God. soon. So, by the way, you guys are um, on our little gadget that I bought. It's like it gets yeah, suction look, no cup. Hands. It gets suction cup to whatever we want to put it on. And um, like the car or tabletop. And it will. The windshield. And it works just fine. And it holds you guys steady so you guys ain't moving. And we don't got to worry about if we're in frame or not. Exactly. I love it. <sighs> but, roadies back is kind of sore sorry um i was like who's over there no i think tomorrow we're gonna go to the track in the morning oh tell them about the ropes roadies we need your help i mean technically we could go to google and just save time but but if you guys know yeah so you guys know like if you guys watch like the biggest loser or like this extreme mate long wait wait makeover gosh i really need to learn how to speak <laughs> So, you know, you have, they have them ropes, the ropes and you... and you do one of these numbers? Boy, that looks kind of weird. I feel like, what's them wrestlers, <laughs> the, 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 the... They oh, did the, this number. The Bush Brothers or whatever, <laughs> not Bushwhackers? We cannot be the Bush Sisters, though. <laughs> that would be no bueno. <laughs> no, what were they called? I want to say they're called the Bushwhackers. The Bushwhackers? I'm almost positive. I'm almost positive. <laughs> Okay, anyways. Any hoozles. Them, them ropes. We're looking for We're looking them. for those ropes. We went to Dick's Sporting Goods today, and the lady looked at me like I was like... No, the lady took us to jump rope. Yeah, she took us to jump rope. So we walk all the way down there, and I'm like, this isn't what I'm talking about. Oh, you know what else I got today, Rodis? My fishing license, so I can go fishing. I'm I excited. Didn't, I didn't get that, because I can't... I don't mind fishing. Fishing's great, but to, I can't hook the little wormy. Wormy? Yeah. First, you gotta cut it in half. Oh! You okay? Sorry, we live in the ghetto. 
was, I was about to stop, stop, drop, and roll. Roadies, that's gonna be it for now. We're going inside for it gets violent. This is my life. Roadies, hope you guys had a wonderful Saturday. Yes. Guess when we'll see you next. Manana!